Hello and welcome to A Book in Two Minutes. My name is Lindsay Milner and I'm a training and development consultant working mainly with non-profit organisations to help them to create awesome workplaces. And while I've been doing that work, I have read many, many, many books. And uh, I thought it might be interesting to share some of the insights that I've gained from those books with you. Uh, the books are management books, books on leadership and management, books on business development, uh, books on thinking, and what's the other one? Personal development. Yeah, most important of all. In fact, most of the books I've done have kind of fallen into the personal development category, I think. Um, today's book is a bit of a crossover, actually, between personal development and effective leadership and management. Um, and it's a follow-on sort of, from one that I did a few days ago, Emotional Intelligence. This book is called Emotional Intelligence 2.0. Um, yeah, there we go. No reflection there. Emotional Intelligence 2.0. And it is by Travis Bradbury and Jean or Jean Greaves, depending on whether that person's a man or a woman, French or American, probably. Um, yeah, so the central premise of this book is uh, a test of your emotional intelligence. And it actually includes, um, at the back, it includes a code. Uh, it's a one-time use, so it's only good for one person, to actually test your emotional intelligence. Which is obviously really useful and then the book itself is very much about how you can improve that the results of your test you can see where you're weak where you're strong and work on developing the areas where you need to make the most improvement and then you can go back and retest it it suggests setting a reminder to go back and retest and see how you've improved after you've been working on the strategies the book itself is full of lots of strategies. Um, oh, sorry, to go back a little step, it's divided into four um, components of emotional intelligence. Um, you might remember from the Daniel Goleman book that there were originally five. Uh, this book talks about self-awareness. Oh, blue bottle. Self-awareness, self-management, uh, relationship awareness and relationship management and obviously empathy which is the one that they've maybe left off uh, kind of comes into the two uh, relationship management categories I'm gonna get that fly <laughs> no I missed he's still buzzing around hopefully he'll leave me alone for a moment um hello just uh, say hello to a couple of people who've joined me victoria who's joined me from the gym well done um i was there this morning so i get brownie points for that too and uh, hello to deborah um where was i so the four categories and then you've once you've done the test online you can see where you need to develop and there's lots of strategies in here for each of those things so for example, in the self-awareness strategies, there are things like um, keep a journal about your emotions, uh, stop and ask yourself why you do the things you do, visit your values, um, on your social awareness strategies, greet people by name, uh, watch your body language, um, don't take notes at meetings, um, watch emotional um, intelligence at the movies, so watch a film and observe for all the emotional cues that, that are included in the film so lots of really really useful strategies in there and I think if you want to work on yourself uh, whether that's for your personal relationships or for your work relationships then obviously this is a really useful thing to do um, one of the downsides of doing these book reviews is that there are loads of books that I kind of want to revisit and this is one that I really want to sort of, uh, oh, where did I get to? Did I practice those strategies or not? How have I done? Um, and repeat the test that I did. My copy of the book is quite old. Um, I think it was published in 2009. And the other thing I wanted to mention, it does say at the beginning of this book that your IQ is unchangeable and your personality is unchangeable 
Well, for anybody who was paying attention and heard what I said about mindset the other day, you'll maybe disagree with that. This was published a couple of years after mindset, but maybe they hadn't read it by then. Um, so obviously I do want to dispute that part of it, that your personality is unchangeable, that your mindset is fixed and forever. But obviously it's a strategy that you can work on. Hi Andy. Um, so yeah, if you want to improve your personal relationships, your working relationships, um, how you manage your team, then I definitely, definitely recommend this book. It is still available from Amazon, even though mine's a few years old now. So that's today's book in uh, five minutes. Um, Emotional Intelligence 2.0 by Travis Bradbury and Jean Greaves. Available at all good bookstores now, I would think. Um, if you've come across it, if you've come across Emotional Intelligence, let me know what you think. I'd love to see your comments. And uh, otherwise, I will see you back here tomorrow, same time, same place, Facebook Live at 4pm for a book in two minutes. Bye.